Indianapolis rounds out another violent year. There will be countless families celebrating this holiday without a loved one because of gun violence. And tonight, as our Max Lewis shows us, one local mother is using that painful reality to try and spread joy to others and inspire the next generation. The dance floor was hopping at the Far East Side Neighborhood Center tonight. Kids and their families celebrating the holiday as part of the Untold Foundation's third annual Winter Wonderland. They'll be dancing, winning prizes, and just enjoying themselves because a lot of them might not be able to enjoy themselves at home. So I want them to enjoy being a kid for a moment. Along with dancing, kids have the opportunity to enjoy some hot chocolate, decorate ornaments and cookies, and enjoy a warm meal. All of it put on by Antonia Bailey, who wishes two of her children were here to witness it. It's bittersweet, so sometimes it brings tears, especially since birthdays just passed. So this is my birthday gift to them. Her son Nicholas would have been 20 this year. Her daughter Ashlyn would have turned 19. The two siblings were shot and killed in their apartment while getting ready for school in August of 2019. Antonia says her life isn't and never will be the same. The morning of her birthday, I cried like a baby because I can't see what a 19-year-old looks like. I can't see what a 20-year-old looks like. I can't see the fruits of my labor and all the love that I poured into my children. Since then, she has made it her mission to combat gun violence in the city and to show children their potential in life. She says many of the people who came tonight know her pain all too well. It's heartbreaking, and I hate that so many parents now have to see what life is like without their children. The goal of the Winter Wonderland, she says, is to let kids be kids, even if only for this one night. Clothes, books, and toys were there for them to take. Antonia hopes this party will give these kids hope and help address the city's violence problem one child at a time. I wish that these children would put down these guns. Their future is so bright. If only they would give themselves a moment to allow them to see it. On the Far East Side, Max Lewis. Fox 59 News. Bailey and her foundation also hold a toy drive every year in honor of her two children. For more information on her upcoming events, you can go to our website at fox59.com. Police believe a missing car led to a kidnapping.